That was a close one. I didn't expect to be jumped on like that. And those ridiculous masks they wore. Very tacky. Good to know that cultists will always be the same, no matter what era. Could I read that note you've been reading? Thanks. Hmm. I recall an old book about this cult in the castle's library. This... Mirak, though. I've read some stories about him. He was supposed to be the first dragonborn who ever lived. He was around long before even I was. This might be worth looking into. Nothing else, then? This must be Raven Rock. Never thought I'd see it myself. It looks... fascinating. I had always been curious to see Dunmary's settlements for myself. I'd love to explore this place when we have some time. Though, something feels off here. I can't pin my finger on it. Just the air, the ground, the smells. It feels so... wrong. Kind of reminds me of the Soul Cairn. Kind of dreary. don't seem to be in quite the same state as they the Very interesting. May I ask what it is you're doing here? Merak, Merak. It sounds familiar, and yet I can't quite place... Oh, wait, I recall. That makes very little sense. Merak's been dead for thousands of years. I'm not sure. But it is fascinating, isn't it? Perhaps it has some relation to what's going on here. Quite unexpected. I'm afraid I can't give you any answers, but there are ruins of an ancient temple of Mirax toward the center of the island. If I were you, I'd look there. Now it's all him. I thought so. Our hands once were idle. Hasn't this Mirak been dead for thousands of years? This all seems strange. Hypnotized like this, and reciting his name. Unless... there's something else behind this. We need to figure this out. What is happening here? This all feels wrong. What is happening to these people? They're all acting like... walking corpses. And not the ones we usually run into. Can you hear what they're muttering? It's a mantra, isn't it? Like their minds are possessed. It's cold. And very, very dusty. I kind of expected this, but gods, this is just a bit too much. <laughs> <laughs> Even as a daughter of Cold Harbor, this is kind of hard for me. We should really get indoors, or even in a cave, somewhere. What now? Ready if you want. He grows ever near to us. You there. What brings you to this place? Why are you here? I am Freya of the Skull. I am here to either save my people, or avenge them. I am unsure. Something has taken control of most of the people of Solstein. It makes them forget themselves, and work on these horrible creations that corrupt the stones, the very land itself. My father, Storm, our shaman 
says Mirak has returned to Solstein, but that is impossible. Then you and I both have reason to see what lies beneath us. Let us go. There is nothing more I can do here. The tree stone and my friends are beyond my help for now. We need to find a way into the temple below. I sense a trap. Spring the trap. friend here. We help people out with these sorts of things. Interesting. We need to find a way into the temple below. You heard her. She may be our best bet in making sense of this whole mess. If you have more questions, I suggest you ask Freya, at least around these parts. She's definitely more knowledgeable than I am. Seems wrong somehow. Here, yet. You're a great alchemist. You know. to you. You read the book and then... It seemed as though you were not really here. I could see you, but also see through you. Where? Where is he? Can we reach him? Can we kill him? This is a dangerous thing, then. We should return to my village and show this to my father. Perhaps Storm can make sense of what is going on. There looks to be a way out through here. Oh no, you actually did it. By the gods. But honestly, I'm glad you're okay. Almost thought I lost you there. From what you've shared with Freya, I think you were taken to a realm of oblivion. As for the specifics, and how you saw Mirak there, I'm not too sure. Freya's village should have our answers. But next time, don't go reading Daedric books so easily. You're lucky you were able to get back, 
Some people never do. Yes? Well, I'm here. Less dust, but more snow. Not exactly much better. You see that green light? That I comes still from can't the imagine window. that we set where my snow elf work against their will. The forgotten they must be freed soon. The village is just ahead. Storn has used his magic to raise a barrier around it, protecting the few of us left. That the barrier is still there is a good sign. Yet hope. Freya, what news do you bring? Is there a way to free so, our people? This must be the place she no, was talking about. But I have brought someone who has seen things. He has confirmed that Mirak is indeed behind so, suffering. This must be the place she was talking I feel about. That it would be so. But how is that possible? After all this time. So, this must I be the place she was talking about. We do not yet know. Please, tell Storm what has happened. So you have seen things, yes. My magic grows weak, and so does the barrier around our village. Time is short. Tell me what you know. How do you know this? The legends speak of that place. Terrible battles fought at the temple. The dragons burning it to the ground in rage. They speak also of something worse than dragons buried within. Difficult to imagine, but if true, it means what I feared has come to pass. Mirak was never truly gone, and now has returned. If you could go to this place and see him, are you like Mirak? Are you dragonborn? Then perhaps you are connected with him. The old tales say that he too was dragonborn. I am unsure. It may mean that you could save us, or it may mean that you could bring about our destruction. But our time here is running out. The few of us left free of control cannot protect ourselves for much longer. You must go to Sering's Watch. Learn there the word that Mirak learned long ago. And use that knowledge on the Windstorm. You may be able to break the hold on our people there and free them from control. All maker shall so, this must be the place she was talking about. To think these people live as the ancient Nords once did. My people. 
I'm a little excited to be standing in a Skald village. I've read and heard stories about the Skald, but to be here, it's... <laughs> I'm just happy. Hey, so... Looks like you know where to go next. Though, I'm sorry it's up to you to save these people. Just know that you're not alone. I'll be right here with you, whatever happens. I'll be keeping an eye on you.